Hi everyone, Petey here from Triple G Comics. I've got a hot toy grail. How's it hanging guys? Right, so you knew if I'd bought a Batman 89, I'd have to go and buy this beast. Look at that. So this is the Joker 89 based on Jack Nicholson. Um, the box art is similar to the Batman 89, which I opened previously. Stunning. Um, Joker's face in kind of a silver ink there the box is really smart it just looks really classy and nice so again it's got the magnetic opener you open that out it's got a little blurb about the joker here which tells you a little bit about him and then on the front here it's got the famous line tell me something my friend have you ever danced with the devil by the pale moonlight we also have a pull out same as the batman one with a, a little joker image on which is pretty cool. Pop that back in there. We'll take that off. Oh, look at that. Look at that, man. There we have him. Jack in all of his glory. Um, we'll take the card off. Oh, I absolutely love it. I mean, that's the spit and double of Jack Nicholson. It's phenomenal. So take the card off. And there we have, same as the Batman one. We'll have the figure with a variety of his hands. Um, I think this one comes with a separate coat as well. We've got his hat there as well. We'll just take that out carefully, put him to one side. And there we'll have a whole host of um, accessories and bits and bobs that go with the actual figure. Okay, let's just get it out. Okay, so we get normal Batman 89 stand with the Joker on again with the LEDs that move around if you so desire. I won't be using the LEDs, I don't think. Um, then, same as the Batman one, we get an enormous amount of add ons and bits and bobs. So, let's just go through them. First things first, you get a whole array of different hands um, pointing hands, open hands, all these kind of different things that go with the different accessories. Tons of different switch outs or options there. You get, oh, let's have a look where to start. His gas mask, I love that. You get his remote control, a little version, which is quite smart. You get, obviously, his hat which is a nice material <laughs> two packs of these um, dollar bills well hundred dollar bills with a little joker emblem on them and these are literally tons of notes so you can chuck them around the base if you so desire you get his large gun you get a smaller version of the gun with the bang on, which I love. You can take that out and just have a normal revolver. The detail on this is phenomenal. So it's got a little latch here at the bottom. Um, the trigger works and then if you uh, pop it open, you've got the rounds inside. So phenomenal detail. Once again, we've then got, and I love these, a little set, set of false teeth. These are spring action. We'll get his cane a staff, little set of Joker playing cards, his megaphone, his posy, and then we get an additional coat. I'm not quite sure, I'm not quite sure about that. So we'll get two coats with them. I'll try them both on too, I think. Um, so that's it, tons of accessories, really cool looking stuff. Have to say, I probably will end up using some of these accessories, or like the Batman ones, because I just like them. Okay, figure itself is absolutely superb. I mean, just look at that, I love it. Absolutely love it, the costume is superb. Look at the figure, I mean, that's Jack Nicholson. It's absolutely amazing. And again, like the Batman one, this one, you take the head off the back of the head, and you kind of just, his eyes make them look wherever you want them to to look which is quite spooky 
Um, I don't know if they've changed this design because this is an old figure, but that does leave quite a ridge, which is noticeable. Um, but yeah, the material in the costume is beautiful. Uh, it's it's film accurate. It just looks looks tremendous. Love the fact that they've gone to such detail as to even give them little material socks. <laughs> um, I love them. So let's get them posed and let's get them on the turntable. Love that joker. Okie dokie guys, as you can see, um, I've got him posed. Yeah, I think he looks tremendous. As with many of these hot toys I'm finding, um, I'm probably not gonna use a lot of the accessories. Uh, they are nice to have, but really all I've used on, on this one is the hat and the posy. I am gonna have a bit playing try the other jacket on, which I'll do in a second here, but I'm pretty sure this is how I'm gonna display him. I think he looks absolutely amazing. He looks just like the Joker from, from the movie in my mind. Um, the quality is superb, the lightness of Jack Nicholson. I mean, just look at that face, it's absolutely amazing. I just think he looks phenomenal, absolutely phenomenal. Um, really impressed, this is probably my favorite hot toy that I've opened so far. Um, although I did love the Optimus Prime, I have to say. Um, but this one is just streets ahead of everything I've opened. I love it, absolutely love it. Right, I'm gonna stop it there and we'll try the other jacket on and see what I think. Guys. This is going to be tough. I don't know which one I prefer in. I like that coat as well. Um, oh dear, I do. No. So basically, this is kind of a thicker outdoor coat, I guess you would say. Um, and that one's more of these kind of classic top and tails. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. Which one do you guys think? Let us know in the comments which, which look you prefer. Mm. Okay guys, so that's the Hot Toys Joker, Jack Nicholson figure. Um, looks absolutely amazing, I love it. Um, it just looks stunning. Cannot wait to get it in my cabinet with my other Batman stuff. Okay, thanks very much for watching. We'll catch you next time.